All right, so one important aspect here. If you don't have this tube, this bridge here, which is this bridge here, if you don't have this bridge, then the ions won't move between the two beakers. And if the ions cannot move between the two beakers, the current will not move. So this salt bridge is very important because what's happening, the electricity is being carried by the ions in solution. And if you don't have this ion mobility, you won't have this electric current that you see here. What's in the salt bridge is a strong electrolyte. That strong electrolyte, its function is to move either to the anode compartment or the cathode compartment to basically neutralize the excess ions. So which ions is gonna move to which compartment? Let's look at the anode compartment. What is building up at the anode? So at the anode, you're producing zinc ion. At the cathode, you are consuming the copper positive two because the copper positive two convert, convert to copper. So what do you have excess sulfate? So you have excess sulfate at the cathode. So look what's happening. The excess sulfate moves through the salt bridge to the anode. So as a result of that, you have a movement of ions. So the ions are moving between the two beakers. 